I forgot whether I like made a Facebook post about it or like me and me or him confronted. I forgot. I forgot what happened. But either way, somehow you know we confronted her and shit. You know whether it, whether it was a fucking Facebook post that I made or like a YouTube video that I made. Whatever it was, I forgot exactly what the fuck happened. But um, I think it was a Facebook post. But I don't know for sure. Any bottom line. You know, it happened, whatever. And then she, she makes, and th 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 bro, I promise, I put that on everything I fucking love. I hate people like this. I cannot stand people like this. I can't stand people, right? When you have all the fucking evidence to prove that they're a slime son of a bitch, but they keep on fucking, they keep on, you know, got, oh, another part that I forgot to fucking mention about the fucking story. I keep forgetting shit. So there's a point, there's a part of the night where her uh, friends, Okay, so, so remember I told y'all that, that her friends took her friends took me to my house so I could go change. So after I got dressed, we uh, drove to their house to go change and shit. Uh, we uh, drove back to their house so they could change. And there's a point in time where where, uh, where where me and her was in the car. And shit keep on not focusing. There was a point in time where like me and her was in the car. And she told me a story. She was like uh, Tyshawn, you know, I'm gonna tell you something. So I'll go ahead and tell me. She's like, you know, on this point in time, where, like, I, I was in foster care. I was like, yeah, you told me that before. You know, cause like, this is a girl who's like in foster care and shit. Because she told me that her, she told me that her mom was abusive and shit. Her, her mom just always beat her up and shit. She said one time that her mom actually stabbed her in the back with a knife and shit. I'm like, damn. And um, I'm like, fuck, goddamn. And uh, she said that she was in foster care and shit like that. And she used to be in like multiple foster homes. Matter of fact, uh, at prom, she uh, she uh, actually had a foster dad who picked her up and shit. But anyways, she told me that how, like it was one time that she had a foster parent and when she was six years old. And she said when she was six years old, this uh, foster parent who was an old man um, had her give him head every single day. Every single day when she was only six years old, he was like 60 something. I'm like, wow, bro. And she like, she like, Tyshawn, you know, because I was molested at a young age, that's the reason why I'm so super sexual. And I promise you, bro, it's so crazy because if if you watch porn, if you watch porn star girls interviews, like like you watch the interviews, a lot of them say the same shit. You know, um, I was molested, and that's why like I'm super horny and shit. You know, I was sexually assaulted or whatever. It, like I like I don't know how girls work or like how people work. Shit, it's, 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 it's even for dudes, too. Like, if a, if a little boy is molested at a young age or if he's raped at a young age, that can make him be, that can make him a homosexual, okay? You would think, okay, or or if a girl been raped or molested at a young age, whatever, that makes them super horny. You would think, because you've been sexually molested or assaulted, you would think, you would think, you would think that, like, that would make you, like, be more scared of sex and, like, not want to have sex and be, like, more afraid of sex. Some girls are like that. But a lot of times it, it, it uh, makes them even more sexual. I don't know what the fuck it does with their brain or some shit, but it, but it, it it makes them more sexual based on the fact that, that they got assaulted or whatever or molested. I'm like, damn, bro. I'm like, I'm like, you know, I'm like, I kind of feel bad for like, I'm like, <laughs> I feel bad for motherfucking trying to trying to fuck your ass because th this is the reason why you're fucking like this. <laughs> And she was like, she was, she, she like, no, it's fine, you know. She, she, she like, no, it's fine, you know. Um, I actually like, you know, I actually like doing this stuff. It's just that's that, that's the reason why. I'm like, wow. So the reason why you're a freak is because some old man. Molest I'm like, wow. That that's not a fucking good reason. <laughs> that's, not, that's not that's not uh you know that that's not like a uh like you know good thing to say, bro. Like. Damn, like you know now, if you say if you say hey, you know there's one time where I was a virgin, you know I had a boyfriend that fucking rocked my world and he brought the freak out of me. Okay, that's different. Okay, that's cool. Where you saying oh yeah, you know um, yeah, you know um, I was molested and that's why I'm freak. <laughs> that shit don't sound right. But 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 she said but she said she said that she actually likes it, but it's just that's the reason why. I'm like man, that's fucked up. But uh, I'm like damn man. But anyway, but back to the, back to the. Back to the conclusion of the story. So we found out whatever like that. And back to what I said. I can't stand people to where you have all the evidence to prove that they're on some bullshit. Or, you know, you know, like, you like ever see, you ever watch like a video of a cop pulling somebody over 
or a cop or like a judge or whatever like that, and they have all the evidence to show that you that you want some fucking bullshit, and the person like, oh no 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 no, bro, like shut the fuck, like she the same way. You have all the evidence, fucking fingerprints, fucking bodily fluids on the scene, fucking video footage, fucking pictures, everything, and she'll be like, oh no, blah blah. Yeah, like, motherfucker, shut the fuck up. You know you want some bullshit. You know you want some fucking fuck shit. You know what I'm saying? Shut the fuck up, man. But shut the fuck up. Damn, bro. Like, and somehow she got caught and, and, and she's putting shit on me. You're she, She's the one that got caught and she's putting it on me like I did something. Like, motherfucker, you the one who did this dumb shit, motherfucker. How was it my fault? You did it. You feel me? You... You're the one talking to two friends, two friends at the same time, and and somehow didn't like both of us went to the same exact school, and we talk and we talked to each other outside of school. So, well, not really like that, but like we were like cool and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like motherfucker, and you and you see us almost every day together. You didn't expect at some point one of us was gonna like was gonna was gonna mention you at, at some point, and like you was gonna get caught at the very least. Talk talk somebody. That goes to a different school, not the not the same school, you dumbass. Especially when you see us hang out with each other, you stupid motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, she like she like try to point the finger at me and shit. So, oh, you're the problem because this, 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 this. man, shut the fuck. After that, man, like I ain't even talk to her no more. I said, man, no. So there's one day that she like tried to call me and shit. She 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 tried to call me to try to like, she because like she was pissed off or about something, and she called me and she as soon as she called me. I, Shit, I fucking hung up. I said, nope. <laughs> nope. She didn't, cause uh no, what happened was um my friend Adrian called her and me to, to have to have like a little group conversation to to discuss everything. And you know, just just to finally talk and just discuss it. But once she fucking answered, once she said, hey Tyshawn, I said, Psh, hell no, I'm done. I said, man, because during that time, shit, during that time school was over. Uh what? Yeah, school was over, I think. Okay, so after that, okay, so after that. We uh, had graduation. Graduation was good. Uh, graduation, you know, we uh, actually hung out and shit, and we was cordial at graduation. You know, we was cordial and shit. You know, and uh, we we uh, talked for like a little second at graduation and shit, and then uh, um, after everything was over with, um, what happened? No, 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 no. That was wait. No, that was that was practice grad because like we we pretty much had to. Uh, practice our graduation so we like know where to sit and like know what to do and and during during the practice graduation it was all good like you know we was talking and shit you know I guess we moved past the shit again but I think after fucking graduation my fucking uh um Adrian wanted to no no no, no that was before that I think I don't know what the fuck that happened but all I want to say was you know that was the end of it uh like I don't know if she called me before graduation or after it was over with, but there was one time she, she, she tried to talk to like discuss the shit, and I said nah, whatever. I'm, I said click. <laughs> but that, yeah, yeah, that's the last time I seen her again was like uh, graduation and shit. Um, I don't, yeah, 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 yeah. That was that was practice graduation. Yeah, that was practice graduation. What was it? Oh, or was it graduation? I forgot which one. It was. I, don't, I don't fucking remember. But yeah, man, that girl pissed me off so fucking much. <laughs> But like, like she, the thing about her, even though she, okay, the cons, she's fucking not faithful. She's insecure about herself. Even though she looks good, she's insecure about herself. Uh, and shit like that. And so yeah, she's not faithful. She's insecure, and she she stinks. But like I said, cause she's so pretty, I still got, I still, I still put up with the shit. Now, and listen, you, but listen, all time show yo nigga. You know, you like dirty girls. Like, no, motherfucker, she was pretty. That, that's why I fucking stuck around. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that, and that's it. Uh, pro, she's funny. Because most girls ain't funny, but she was funny. Uh, you know, she you know, she was, even though she was, even though she been on bullshit, she was still fun to hang around. She funny, she a freak, and, you know, shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But she was still cool to hang around and shit, bro. You know, she was still cool, but, like, Nah, bro. She's nah. She, you know, if I was keep talking to her, that girl would fucking drive me crazy, dog. So you know, I, uh, I had left it alone and shit. And that was the last time I heard about her and shit. Um, um, no, like, no. 
Oh, well, you know, no, okay, there's some other time, there's some, there's something else that she did, like, there's, she, she, she fucking, told, so, so, like, so, so, like, a year later, she, uh, wanted a car and shit, and she, like, asked some dude, she's like, hey, um, hey, um, uh, I'm in, I'm in, uh, I'm in, I'm in desperate need for a car, so, uh, because I don't have no money, I will, I will have sex with you for a whole week, <laughs> yeah, she was like, yeah, you know, we could, uh, do it. With, with condoms worn for a whole week, and I also I, and I also let you do anal and shit. <laughs> and the dude fucking put the fucking text messages on fucking Facebook. That shit got hundreds of fucking laughing emojis and shit. And she was salty as hell. She was like, "Oh no, you know uh, my fucking Facebook got hacked. That wasn't me and shit like that." And uh, um, well, that's that's what her friend told me. That that's what her friend told me that that's what she said. And you know. I believed her and shit, but uh, my friend Adrian said, you know, that was my cousin, or like, yeah, that was my cousin or uncle that she was talking to, and, um, <laughs> and, uh, no, because I, oh, uh, you know what, yeah, man, I, th I think, I think my boy Adrian was still talking to her, even, even after, like, high school was over, because I, I was done with her after that shit, but I think he was still talking, you know, all of us were young and dumb at that time, you feel me, so, like, you know, but after that, you know, he said, oh, yeah, you know, I'm done with you after that shit because you, you fucking was looking stupid. <laughs> she like, no, it wasn't me, bro. That wasn't me. Da, da, da. He said, no, I'm done with your life. Fuck out of here. And then that's when he was done and shit. But yeah, man. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, that was some dumb ass. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. But yeah, you know, um, see, back then, you know, um, which, you know, I already mentioned this. Back then, I was obsessed with anal. Now, I don't really care about it now. But back then, when I was like a little high school teen watching a lot of porn, that's all, that's all I used to watch. And every girl, every girl I talked to always asked her, hey, you know, would you ever do anal? Most of them said no. But she said, yeah, I would try it. And, but, so, um, I think around the time that she asked him that, I think she maybe tried it and she liked it. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? So that's why she said that shit. But yeah, bro, like shit, that, yeah, I used to be obsessed with that shit, so I'm like, shit, I could shit. You will try it? Psh, I'm gonna fuck you in the ass, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Back, like I said, now, like, I ain't into that shit, but back then I was crazy about that shit. So I was, so, I, so I guess a pro, another pro at the time, well, not a pro now, because I don't give a fuck now, but at the time, she didn't ain't no, but now I don't give a fuck about that shit no more. But yeah, bro, that girl about that bullshit, dog. <laughs> I would, bro. But honestly, it's my fault. You think about it, it's my fault because all the all the signs were there. Tyshawn, she has a boyfriend and she's trying to fuck you. you leave the chick alone. <laughs> the signs were there. She no, she no, she has a boyfriend and she's talking sexually to you. Leave her, you know, the, the, you know, signs are there, bro. Sometimes, a lot of times, you gotta blame yourself for dumb decisions because if the signs are there and you choose to continue not to read the signs, it's your fault. Well, no, she, no, bro, no, but you know. She's the one that did that. Well, okay, but, but the signs were there and, and you still kept talking to her. It's your fault, motherfucker. So it was my fault and they, you know, talked to her. But yeah, but that story, dog. This the uh, fucking crazy ass girl, man. Yeah, bro. So yeah, man. I uh, pretty much gave her a chance the, the last year. I gave her a chance senior year. I gave her two chances, it didn't work out. I'm done, bro. And like that, that was the last thing, that was the last thing that I heard from her. There's there's one point where um you know, a long time ago, like, I had, like, went to her Facebook to, like, see what she was doing, and, uh, I, I think she's in the military now, but, like, she, you know, she doesn't really post like that, but, you know, I think she's in the army now and shit, but, yeah, bro, yeah, she used to piss me off, and, like, you know, there's some other details, I mean, I mean, there's some little bonus, some little bonus shit, you know, you know, that I left out, because, like, you know, I, I ain't trying to keep having, like, all these little side notes and shit, but, you know, a little bonus shit that I could have brought, you know, mentioned, but you know that's the main gist of the shit. You feel me? But yeah, man. Uh, um, I, and bro, I know for a fact if if I would see her again, even though I'm 21, bro, I know for a fact that like shit that like she would like try to talk to me again. I, like I just know she would. I know she would. Like I just, I, bro, I feel that if I happen to bump into her again later in life, so you touch on You know, let's have part three. Let's motherfucker. Hell, yeah, fuck no, girl. What touch on? You know, that was back when we were kids, you know, 17, 16, we're, we're adults now, you know, I fuck no girl, no, <laughs> hell no, no, we done, well, but that was back then, I don't give a fuck, we done, 
Okay? We done. That's all I gotta say, bro. I'm out of here.